is pushing for answers about PCB testing at NC State's Poe Hall. Two outside experts say 17 air samples were taken and that there were not enough to accurately show how much of the cancer-causing toxins are in that seven-story building. People who worked and study at Poe Hall also tell WRAL they want the university to explain this. We asked for more information. NC State would only say the report speaks for itself. Our team followed up and sent this email asking again for specific insight as to how Geosyntec decided to take just 17 air samples instead of hundreds of samples, which other experts say is needed. A university spokesperson didn't respond to that question Friday when we asked and didn't respond when we asked the same question again this morning.